We took a trip to El Salvador. Stay tuned, like, comment, and subscribe, and watch us go through this journey. So this trip was very relaxing. This was at the top of our Airbnb. I will put the link in the description box below. We didn't see a lot of bugs out here. It was very safe to travel to. We used our translator. It cost $12 to get into El Salvador. No American Express. We used a car service. I will also link them below. They kept us very safe. We requested someone that spoke English and Spanish just for, you know, our personal reasons. This was the beautiful view from the Airbnb again. This is just giving a small little tour just from the view. I didn't even go to all the rooms, but it was three bedrooms. And of course, we stayed in the master bathroom and it had three bathrooms in there. We stayed in the master room, sorry. <laughs> so still going through, um, on our first day, we went to a restaurant called Beto's, B-E-T-O-S. It was near the water. They have three locations. Um, and this drive was like an hour and a half. And we took an Uber. Uber was very affordable as well. I'm an early bloomer, so I was up early just to catch the views. And again, this trip was so refreshing and relaxing. Look at that view. God is amazing. Just reflecting, praying, you know. So then got dressed. We're getting ready to go to our excursions, but we had to stop by and get some breakfast. We went to San Martin. Um, and they were really nice customer service. 10 out of 10. Um, they found someone that spoke English, but we also used our translator <laughs> on our phone. So their breakfast was, you know, pretty traditional. Um, it was really good, actually. All of the fruit was fresh, drinks, top tier. We took a two hour drive to these excursions, y'all. And the two that I wanted to do were closed, but they're very affordable. The hot springs, relaxing. Now the massage, it was okay, but it wasn't a resort type of massage. Oh, that swing. Mm -mm, mm -mm, honey. <laughs> I just like taking pictures. I just thought that was funny. We're at the hot springs again. Um, later on, our driver, Leo, he had dropped us off to this plaza with all of these restaurants so we can eat they say when you when you're in El Salvador you have to try to put some now to each his own okay <laughs> um I got me a chicken salad one night we was out all night this is just showing uber rides just make sure you use your google maps for common sense oh to get in the clubs men you cannot have on shorts if you have on shorts you are not getting in the club like at all my man spilled some drinks on me because it was his birthday he didn't mean to so i had to change this was his birthday dinner we went to Don L. Michael, they the service was like a six out of ten. Um, I didn't eat that meat, I ate the shrimp. Um, uh, they didn't really have anyone there that spoke English, um, and they were kind of offended because we didn't eat pork. I don't know. We found us a club, this club was real chill vibe, drinks were good, it was real chill. Like, we were you know there to relax, great atmosphere. They had them all, y'all. We found them all, but we didn't find any deals. They had an art gallery. We went there. Um, this was also at the mall. And this is just footage of the mall. We found this nice coffee bar. Gabe and David were awesome. They are the ones who recommended all of the local spots to go to so we wouldn't be driving hours away. This place right here, the way that food looked on that menu. No, wait, this still the coffee okay boom boom this is the coffee so the coffee it was good we're still on good beans i had to leave them a great review because they were really inf like informative uh, and everything. This is okay now this place that they told us about y'all the way their menu looks is the way their food look i'm not over exaggerating hands down 10 out of 10 even though um 
they didn't speak English. They still, you know, did their best. Like, I just love the people here. They were so nice. They were so understanding. They even encouraged you to practice your Spanish and they practiced their English. Like, it was so dope. It was a great experience. This is a out. This is a boring But we were just playing around in that happy. Of course, we got to watch some Trick Daddy. This was at the airport. Great photo prop. We always find us a lounge because we are Amex Platinum members. And we going to eat and drink for sure. El Salvador was definitely a vibe. And I would definitely go back.